Hey dudes, what's up? This is Crew Dog Gamer, and I am coming at you from the new Fishing Planet map, Lone Star Lake, using my new Fishing Planet DLC, uh, Heavy Bobber. Yeah, that sounds about right. So, uh, I fished this a little bit to try and get a feel for it, and I don't have a feel for it at all. So I'm basically just running around trying to figure out where the bass are, and... It's not going very well, but we're going to win. We're going to succeed. It's going to be all right. Uh, the new Heavy Bobber DLC is really, really damn nice because you can finally, finally have a rod that can take 30-pound line. Uh, you still won't find a whole lot of reels that will take that line too well, um, but, you know, it's a work in progress. At least we had a rod that can do it now. I can go fish for fucking, you know, gar and stuff without worrying about my reel being a bitch about it. But it's all right. Everything's good. You know, we're just fishing for some bass here. Maybe here in a minute we'll get a bite. I'll be able to show you guys a fucking fish on this new awesome fishing planet lake. Hey, here we go. All right, so I found a fish. I'm hoping it is one of these spotted small mouse. That only took me... 40 in-game minutes. Holy shit, this fish is losing his goddamn mind. No, it must be a pickerel. Yep, grass pickerel. Woo, that'll fill the bank up, buddy. But hey, we caught a fish. Uh, and if you guys are wondering where I caught that, I'm using a six ounce number two casting spoon silver in color. And I just happened to cast back in this little cove here. Um, I just saw a guy catch a spotted spotted smallmouth so we're gonna keep trying for that and you will be here when it does happen hey fish number two oh, it's another pickerel I think we're gonna tear the pickerel up today guys these are not filling the bank uh, in case you're wondering this this whole pond was really created for the low-level fishermen um, kinda like an alternative to Missouri um, because to, to catch some good fish in Missouri you still have to be kind of high level um, and you can pretty much come in here with absolutely nothing good uh, nothing high level at all and you can you can still catch a good bit of fish and you can you can make that money that you need to make and you can kind of get that grind going when you first start and it's a little bit more casual there's not as much uh, you know 50 pound trophy fish and shit like that like North Carolina or even Missouri, if you know how to fish in there. Mm -hmm. Which, if you guys would like to see that, uh, I can post a how to catch garfish in Missouri video. Um, it's not as hard as you think. It's actually pretty easy. Uh, to get them to bite, to bring them in is a whole other fucking story. But if you guys want to see that, please let me know. Uh, I can totally, totally hook you up with that video. Oh, wow, okay. So there's a, a, a composite pile, uh, which is poop, in case you didn't know, um, where you can go to look for worms on this map so you don't have to spend money on bait. That's pretty, that leads me, hang on. That leads me to believe that these motherfuckers work real damn good here. So we got a one knot hook, we got some line that's way too goddamn big, and some bait that's pretty small. So we're gonna see. I just wanna see. Hey! Hey hey, we might have hooked onto something decent this time. Uh, I can't see it. It is, it's pulling a little drag though. Okay. Oh, it looks like we got one. Looks like we finally got one of these bass. Yeah. All right. That's a pretty cool looking fish. Yeah. Solid looking little bass, man. So that's pretty cool for the new guys. You don't need anything special. Just a casting spoon. Uh, I don't think it takes too much to, to get the casting spoon, if I remember correctly, but, you know, 
Uh, I cast it in the same spot I just caught that grass pickerel. Uh, you can see where I was reeling because um, I do this whole cut thing. But that's actually the biggest. That's the biggest spotted bass I've seen caught so far. Um, so, holy shit! While I'm talking to you, let's latch on to another. What is this? This doesn't seem like it was. It's as big as the bass was. She is not pulling dry. I think it's just another pickerel. But yeah, it's, it is. But you know, hey, that's pretty cool. You, uh, you newer guys, you don't have to have anything crazy good. Um, I fished around the lake a lot. You know, I've spent like four in-game hours fishing so far, and I would tell you that this cove is where you want to be in that little cut there, and that little cut there with whatever kind of spoon lure you want to use uh, uh, any of these casting spoons uh, I think I saw some guys um, using slop spoons um, they were talking about that and I think the casting spoons would probably be your best bet um, yeah quarter ounce number one or number two hot hook I just got another bite uh, and just cast back there and do a little stop and go with it. If you don't know what stop and go is, I think I just hooked another. Yeah, I just hooked another tiny fish. You can really catch these grass pickerel quite a good bit, and they're not hard to catch. And you know they're good grind fish. Uh, my basically my impressions of this map so far um, are this is going to be a very. It's just like the rest of them. It's a very grindy map. Uh, you know, you got to catch a lot to get a little bit. You can see I've been fishing forever, and I've only got four pounds. God, why does that look so pixelated? Um, so, there's really no big fish in this lake that I can tell. Um, who knows? There may be 50-pound catfish sitting in the middle of it. Uh, it doesn't say anything about it. It just says young channel cat. Um, that's about all there is man I think this is a really good map for new level guys or people who don't really know what they're doing they just kinda wanna get a feel for the game there's not a whole lot to it uh, you know you're gonna catch a lot of a lot of smaller fish which is okay cause that's what you're gonna catch pretty much everywhere else but here you know you you don't have to pay any money to come here which is really good and you know, you can kind of just catch all these little fish and you're not going to feel intimidated. You'll be like, well, shit, this guy's catching, you know, 40 pound catfish. Why can't I do that shit? And then you're just going to get discouraged and you're not going to play the game anymore. And, I mean, it's a, it's a really good map for, for low level dudes. So, you know, you don't have to spend anything, so you make a lot of money um, in that initial stage. You know, you make, you make money instead of just losing it going somewhere. Because that's what I did when I first started playing the game. I'd tell you to come here and you know get a feel for the game, see if you like it. Uh, yeah, that's about it. It's a good low-level map. There's small fish, not a whole lot of equipment needed. You can fill up your stringer and feel good about it. Oh, there we go. See, it's not too difficult to catch fish. And I just got another one of the spotted bass, which is really cool. That's actually a cool fish. That's nowhere else in the game that I know of. Um, so yeah, that, that's about all I got for you. Get a casting spoon, get some worms, get some good uh, small bass baits, a one aught or you know like a number eight, number seven hook ish. Uh, you don't want to get too big with it because obviously these fish are not very big. Um, I'm Crew Dog Gamer. This is my first impressions of Lone Star Pond is what I'm going to call it because it's not a lake. Uh, Lone Star Pond in Texas. Definitely come check it out. You know, even for you, you older guys, it's it's still a pretty cool place to come to, and you don't have to pay any money to come to it, so it's pretty awesome. Uh, and you got that cool compost pile, and you get this little cabin you get to look at. And we're gonna go check this cabin out right before the end of the video. What I'm hoping on, uh, I know I kind of sounded like I was gonna end the video. What I'm hoping on is that this. You see how it has the garage there? Uh, to me, that's that's a hopefulness that this is where our boats and stuff are going to be. Because you never see your own house in Missouri. Um, but yeah, anyways, I'm sorry to bring the video on longer than it needed to be. Uh, I'm Crew Dog Gamer. This is Lone Star Pond in Texas. Of course, it's in Texas, fucking Lone Star. Anyways, have a good day, guys. 
Hope you like it. <laughs>